Delay Sound, we're here with Umther Movement. I want to bring a video to you guys. Um, actually, this is a video series, and it's called the Overcoming Series. And um, we're going to um, look at the power of overcoming, and we're going to look at it um, through the eyes of the um, seven churches Jesus talked about in, um, in basically Revelation. We're going to basically be breaking down uh, Revelations 1 through um, 3, or 1, 2, and 3. And um, taking a, just a a good look at this 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 um this 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 promise to an overcomer, um, Jesus promises um, we will reign with him, we will have power with him, um, and and so there is a power in overcoming that we really need to take a look at. This is be the um, the open video. So before we get started, let's get into a word of prayer. Father God, we thank you for um this uh, this opportunity to come before you, Father God, to 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 come together, Father God, and learn your holy word, Father God. We thank you for this opportunity. We also ask that you come in and take over, Holy Spirit, take over and and let the teacher speak the things that you want to speak, and let the listeners hear exactly what you want them to hear. We thank you for Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. All right, so um, as I was saying earlier, um, this video will be more like an intro to the to the to the series. So, um, but we are going to be coming out of scripture in this video. We're going to be coming out the um, coming out of um, Revelations um, chapter one and eighteen. Give you a pre story of, uh, of Revelations um, chapter one. Um, this is um, John getting a revelation um, um, that's given to Jesus by the Father. And uh, Jesus, uh, so Jesus is giving John the Revelator. Or, I don't, I don't know if it, it, it sounds the, the way the Bible speaks. Uh, it sounds like John is there with Jesus, and they both is receiving the uh, revelation. So I'm, I'm not too clear on, on on how that working, but this is John getting the revelation from the Father, uh, from Jesus, either one. And uh, we're gonna come into. Um, uh, uh, Revelations one and eighteen. It's hi actually highlighted in the um in in, in 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 up above in this picture. All right, it says eighteen. I am he that liveth, and was dead, and behold, I am living for evermore. For, um, amen. And have the keys of hell and death. Write the things which thou see, which thou have seest, and the things which are. And the things which shall be hereafter, the mystery of the seven stars which thou showest in the in my right hand, and the seven golden candlesticks, the seven stars are the angels of the churches, and the seven candlesticks which thou showest are the seven churches. All right, so um, a lot of, a lot of people say the seven churches are different churches throughout the history. Right, that these are that these some say well he he was talking to seven churches that was there, and I think it's a little bit of both. God has a power of being in and out of time, so I think he was talking to seven churches there, but then I thought he, I think he was explaining seven different churches in history, but now I really feel like one of these churches is is, is where we're gonna line up in, and we're gonna do this series figure out the right church. That we should be lining up in. It's it's important. It says that the seven golden candlesticks, the seven golden candlesticks are, are are the church, but the seven stars are the angels. Now the reason why the the the, the candlesticks represents the church is because we are physical light bearers. Um, a candlestick is, is what, what at the time would light up a room. And that's what we are. The church, the physical church is what lights up the room. The stars in 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 in, in this um wanna get this right. In his in his right hand, the uh, the seven gold sticks. Well, the stars and the seven gold sticks, they were both in one hand. And it says that um oh, I'm sorry. Let me just read that part again. The mystery of the seven stars which thou seest in my right hand, the, and the seven golden sticks. So they both are in one hand, in his hand. So the, the seven stars are, are the angels, which is the Bible is telling us there's angels over these churches, 
right? That, that's power of the angels over these churches, which is amazing. And then the, 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 the candlesticks are us. And and we have a a, a, a light to be to be shown. Now in this series we're gonna find out about we're gonna find out more about the light and we're gonna find out more about the um the the, the seven different churches. Um but it's it's interesting that, 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 that there's a there's an angel over every church. Right? There's an angel for every candlestick. That's some, that is amazing. That that shows the the, the, the the love that the Father have for us. But um we also in this series gonna get into um I hope at the at the end of this series, after you see every video, you're gonna have an idea, number one, of the power of overcoming, and number two, where should we be in, 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 in the church and what church our lives should line up. Cause ultimately our life lives should line up for one with one of these church. So I'm excited to get it going in this series. Um if you don't see the screen, it says that Jesus is coming back. Are you ready? It's important. This is utmost important, important for you to be ready, for you to be ready for Jesus coming back. And I hope this series gets you there. The best way to be ready is have a relationship with Jesus Christ. Do you know Jesus as your Lord and Savior? Jesus died on the cross, got off the cross, lived the day just to take your sin, to take your sin away. He physically, physically became sin for you. He physically became your sin to put to, to make it more person, personal. My sin was on the cross. My sin was not on the cross with Jesus. And 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 now we have salvation through Him. We have a way out. We have a way to the Father. Most importantly, we have a way to the Father. So I, I ask you guys to um, make sure you see every video in this series. Go to youtube.com slash um third movement. Um see the whole whole series. I'm only advertising this because I believe the series is gonna really help somebody. And I really, really through the series also hope to dispel some of the um the, the, the ways we use the scriptures in and out of context. And you'll understand more when I get there. If you see the screen, it's telling you to like. Please like, comment for community. Subscribe for more um, videos, and we put here to love. Jesus said that love God and love each other. Make sure we love God and we love each other with our walk and less of our talk. Let's have an up there movement.